Yo, what's good? What's good, y'all? Appreciate y'all for clicking the video. We're back with another vid, another basketball workout vid, and I'm glad that we are all together right now because we finna lock in a good one today, guys. Uh, today, uh, just like the previous videos, we got some, you know, some good warm-up drills to get our body warm. We got some ball handling drills to get our, our ball handling warm. And then we also gonna end it up with some great game moves and then we are gonna tighten up with some free throws. And then, you know, also we're gonna get into a little chop session at the end. We're gonna talk to, uh, talk to each other, and, you know, talk about this great workout that we got and we're gonna lock that in, guys. So I just wanna say, again, appreciate you guys. If you haven't already, subscribe to the channel for more great videos just like this one right here. And also uh, smash that like button because it does the video good to get it out to more people. I don't want you, only you guys just watching this video right now. I don't want only y'all the ones to see this video. So smash that like button and let's get it out there and let's spread this love. Let's spread this positivity and let's spread this, this, this good, uh, these good workout vibes, man. I mean, because this was, this is what this is about, guys. You know, this is about connecting with everybody, us creating a community to build to grow and just um just spread nothing but love and, and, and good positivity guys so if you haven't smashed that like button go ahead and do that now also drop a comment guys i'll say this a lot drop comments to let me know what type of videos you guys want to see also what type of uh, basketball workouts that you guys may want to add to your regimen uh whatever you guys want uh just show show uh, drop that in the comment and i if i can provide it or if i can't provide it i could possibly maybe get you guys to somebody else who can uh give you guys that uh knowledge so again guys this is going to be a great one uh thank you guys for locking back in and uh let's get the show on the road but before we begin you know i always like to give you guys a great uh prayer before we get into the workout and before we get everything going so guys let's go ahead and bow our heads for a real quick second and let's get this prayer in and let's lock it in guys dear heavenly father i just want to say lord thank you so much father god for this day thank you father god for this workout that we are about to have right now father god thank you father god for our body our arms our legs our minds our body and our soul to be able to go out and you know glorify you through this game father god let's have a good one today thank you father in jesus name i pray Let's get it. Amen. Let's get it, guys. It's about to be a good one. So let's go ahead and lock this workout in, y'all. Salute. <laughs>
What's good, y'all? What's good? What's good, y'all? So we halfway through the workout. Remember, guys, I say, always take time to, uh, you know, get your breaks in and get your water in. You know what I'm saying? Hydration is key. Without hydration, you're not going to be able to, you know, give your maximum effort. So always give some time to take a step from that workout, sit your behind down, and put some water in your system, rest, and then get back. But again, like I say, don't rest too much to the point where you're chilling. You just want to get a quick little water break and then bounce back and get, you know, and get back on the court. Um, but yeah, guys, uh, we, we work, we working guys. So you, like I say, just get, get this quick little break. Once we get this quick little break, we're going to jump right back and, uh, we're going to finish up with some game moves. And after we finish the game moves, we're going to go into some, uh, free throws and then we'll, that'll, that'll be it for the workout. But, uh, Guys, take some of these, uh, you know, ball handling drills that we did prior uh, to the water break and take some of the, um, you know, the little active warm-ups that I added to the regimen and uh, add these to your game, guys. I'm telling you, uh, once you add this to your game and you consistently do it, I mean, you're going to see a lot of improvement in your game. But also, I want to add this in, guys, before we jump back. It's also important to be playing as well so we're doing these workouts guys but it's important to be playing at least two three times out the week you know what i'm saying you need to be playing and testing your your workouts against competition at least two to three times out the week that way um you will be able to sharpen your toolbox you know because this is this is key working out but you have to go against other people in order to sharpen it it doesn't you know, it doesn't do any good to do all these working out, but you're not actually putting it to the test. So I wanted to leave you guys with that. Make sure you find um, some good quality runs. You know, nothing too crazy, just something uh, enough to test you, you know, to, 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 to get your skills better, to sharpen your skills up, you know. So uh, just make sure you're doing that and you guys will be straight. But hey, man, let's keep this thing rolling. We're not going to stop this train. I want to keep getting out this uh, good work for you guys. And we're gonna keep pumping, guys. So let's go ahead and get back to the court. What's good, what's good, what's good, y'all? We back. So there it is, we have it. Another great workout, another good one in the books. Add that one to the regimen, guys. Go out there, lock that in, and, 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 and take some of these drills, guys, and put them into your workout regimen. And do them consistently. Do these workouts consistently and watch your game improve. Like Just like I said during the water break, guys, find time to hoop. You know, for all my guys, it's, you know, putting these workouts in and putting that uh, time in, find time to hoop. You know, find like two to three hoop sessions throughout the week that's suitable to your uh, your workout, to, to, I mean, to your skill level. Because uh, you don't want to go too, too advanced because you kind of won't be getting your, your work in. You know, find the runs that suit your skill level and work, work, on, it, work on it in a game. You know, we're doing a lot of working out. You know, you're doing a lot of training, but if you don't apply these trainings to actual games, I wouldn't say it's a waste of time, but you're not getting your maximum benefit because that's what we're working out for. But once we get on the court, we feel comfortable, we feel good, 
And also when going to the game, you can find other things that you need to work out when you come back to your, to your workout regimen. So don't forget that playing is just as important as working out, guys. You can't have one without the other. So like I said, find about two to three workouts, uh, not my, my bad, two to three game sessions that you can find throughout the week to work on your skills, guys. So I'm gonna let you guys have it with that. Um, just keep, just keep pushing, guys. Keep pushing, keep working. And uh, I'm gonna see you guys next week for another workout. Let's get it, y'all.